This video is about the Silicon Dust HD Home Run Network Tuner that will hook up via uh, wi uh, wi via LAN, not Wi-Fi, but via LAN connection uh, to your network uh, router. And in, with these two with these two ports, some of the newer ones just have one port. Uh, you can hook up a TV aerial or clear QAM cable, so you can watch it either wirelessly through your network or through a wired connection, just through your home computer network. Um, newer versions will do a H.264 conversion, um, but my current one it just does it has the NPEG-2 and it doesn't do any conversion, which you can hook up to your aerial outside of your house, or if you have rabbit ears, you can hook it up to that. So, I'll just show you how to install it. I already have it on my computer, but it's very easy to install if you have one of these devices for Linux. You just enter it in. Go into the software manager and it comes up. I'll just load it up here. This is what it looks like. I'll show you where it is in the software manager. You just type in, whoa, made everything funny. HD home home run and usually it's just right in there and you just go there and install it very easily that uh, it will be installed in Linux Mint or Ubuntu and probably other systems that have the same other distributions of Linux that have the software manager like this so I'm just gonna show you the tool here it's the HD home run configuration um, so this tool, you can scan through your scan through the frequencies, and uh, and uh, it will tune uh, the channel uh, local over the air channels. So this channel here, which is channel 11.1 .1, CKWS, um, is almost a hundred percent. It is a hundred percent, and um, it's a high definition channel. Whoop. I'm just going to turn my volume down. Actually, you probably don't hear it. I got my headphones on. Um, you don't need to hear the audio. <coughs> but this is a high definition 1080 IP, uh, I uh, channel, and I'm connected to a wireless. Um, wire, uh, I'm connected to the Wi Fi, and it's still working pretty good for high definition if you want to enter to win a free contest <laughs> so uh, this is a pretty good channel it comes in really good it's the only Canadian channel that we get in digital in Kingston where in the states uh, we uh, the American channels we get a lot more American channels maybe maybe a little bit more than 20 on a good day but in Canada, we get one. In America, you get a lot of over-the-air channels. In Canada, you get just one. Well, in Kingston. Okay, so I'm just going to keep scanning. So you just scan through until you find something you want to watch. And uh, play the waiting game. Some channels will have sub channels. That's the nice thing about the American channels. They'll have Me TV. They'll have um, what's the other one? I there's Me TV. There's Bounce TV. All sorts of sub channels. Just full screen it. It just opens up the program in VLC, and then you're ready to go. Um, you can also look at the sub channels by clicking on the program. So this channel here, 41, which is a PBS channel, has three sub channels. So it's dot one, dot two, and dot three. Um, so yeah, that's the tool. Uh, this is also a great tool if you're tuning your antenna and you have a weak signal. Maybe I'll go up here just to find a. Um, if you have a weak signal, you can also get an app that for this for your phone. And you can watch um, videos on your phone or tablet. And if you have a weak, sig 
signal like this one for example if you're tuning your antenna either you have a, a remote control for your outdoor antenna or if you're just tuning your rabbit ears in your apartment you can look at this meter and see if you're if you can get a stronger signal um, the tuner on this uh, silicon dust HD home run is uh, probably one of the best tuners out of any other over-the-air receiver I have that's including TVs and it just has a really sensitive tuner so it can pick up some further away channels that some of my TVs can't pick up so that's a one plus I gotta say about the uh, the silicon dust HD home run and this is the video I just wanted to tell you a few things about it and thanks for watching